No, very good. It's established very well. Um, no, quite happy with how it looked. Oh, I think it's doing um, very well. I think it's going to be a fantastic addition to my uh, wasteland so we can actually make some money out of it. Oh, I'm really impressed. It's, it's grown dramatically the last three or four weeks. Very good. Yeah. I'm really happy with this old bush pasture at the moment. We've got it growing on some very marginal country that a part, uh, that in the past has grown nothing but spiny rush. Be pleased this year because um, it's been the most difficult year we've ever had of planting salt bush. Look, on limited rainfall, the salt bush is growing quite well, and um, if we get some more summer rain, it should uh, grow even quicker than it's already growing. And um, yeah, it's, it's looking quite promising. I think the mounting is the only way to go. I think we get this um, huge big water storage area and it makes it easy access for the plant roots to get a good start. Yeah, in the past we've only scalped um, and certainly haven't had the results, especially through low-lying waterlogged areas. The mounting certainly appears to be uh, beneficial uh, compared to where we didn't mound last year. The mounding has been very successful. Where, where, the mounding, where they've done the mounding against non-mounding, it's uh, the uptake is is 100% against um, a lower percentage. Well, the mounting's very good. It's terrible to run over on the motorbike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Increases the biodiversity on our property. It also increases the fodder availability, and we make use of all this saline water we have. I think as a farmer, I think it's a great project. It's enabled us to get on and um, help uh, revegetate and um, re-establish some new, better plants on some of this um, tougher parts of our farm and also increase the fodder availability. Yeah, like I said, we're, we're pretty wrapped because it's something that we sort of would have liked to have done anyway, but the way things are nowadays, just uh, the price that it was able to get um, supplied and done for really suited us and just made life a lot easier. And as it is, it's all been um, done and with GPS, so it's a lot tidier than it is at home. And yeah, it's, it's all worked out good. Well, hopefully, once the site's completed and established, it'll uh, provide us a bit of feed at critical times of the critical times of the year when the paddocks would otherwise blow away. Oh, I was just good to see some dollars going into on-farm activities that are going to make a difference to difference to what we can do with our our enterprise and also just make the site look a whole lot better. farmers took it seriously, they would realise that A, they have some more productivity on their farm, it increases their value, their capital value, and um, I think it's in total benefit to the whole soil type and the condition of that part of the country that they're trying to rehabilitate. I think it's been a, uh, able to help farmers to see the uh, huge capabilities of, of the different varieties of saltbush and through the partnership with uh, Ian Poolbrook and Green Oil Tree Nurseries we've been able to bring a nursery, a group of farmers together and um, really make a difference to the area. Mm -hmm.